County's top prosecutor, Kimberly Graham, finished the first year of her term replacing attorney John Sacrone, who had been in office for 32 years. Our local fives, Connor O'Neill, had a chance to sit down with Graham about the transitions and leadership from her eyes. You were elected in 2022, and then you took over for attorney John Sarcone, who had been in this position for over three decades, and you talked about your staff just a little bit there. How have they kind of adjusted to this, I guess, shift in leadership almost? Yeah, I, I think it's been incredibly helpful that really the leadership that's changed has just been at the very top. Uh, it's not uncommon for incoming county attorneys to let go of a lot of the management and bring in kind of their own people, so to speak, and I, I just have a different philosophy or belief about that. I don't think that that's important to do unless there's a real reason to do it, like a concrete reason, or if those folks have really um, made it clear that they're not going to be on board with what your mission and vision is for the office, and I didn't find that here. I found that people were really willing to look at things differently. We're having our conversation on International Women's Day, and you're the first woman to be the top prosecutor in Polk County. What does that mean to you? <laughs> well, I think it means we're making progress, which is really great. I, I might be the first woman Polk County attorney, but I don't think I'll be the last. Yeah, why do you say that? <laughs> Well, we've got a lot of really, really good people here in the office, you know, um, super well-qualified women who uh, perhaps one day one of them will want to run 